Hey, what's up? This is Kyle with KyleParish.net bringing you another exciting tutorial using Photoshop CS5. And we are going to take a picture and give it kind of a dreamy effect. It's going to be a quick tutorial, so let's just go ahead and get started. I just brought a picture in here. And if you notice, when you bring a picture in for the first time, it's locked. The the easiest way to, to unlock that is just double click. It just basically you have to rename it. So whatever the name layer zero, it's fine. Um, we need to duplicate this. We can either drag it down here to the create new layer icon, or you can hit Control J and that duplicates it. Okay, with our duplicated picture selected, we're going going to go to image adjustments desaturate basically it just takes all the color out of the picture now we go to filter blur Gaussian blur and that looks pretty good you just wanna blur it out quite a bit you don't want you don't want it like that or, or just a, a tiny tiny little bit on this picture 10 pixel blur is gonna be just fine now we come up here to the blending mode and we're going to select multiply and instantly you have you have a, a nice dreamy looking not sure what you'd really call that but it's a it's a neat effect you see a lot of times uh, photographers will use this in in making a picture just just different look really nice uh, here's the before here's the after now if that's a little too much, you can come up here to the opacity of that layer that we just affected and you can lessen the opacity. But I like it. I like it 100%. If by some chance your picture gets just a little too dark where you're missing out some of the detail that you really want to keep, you can select the original layer, go to Image, Adjustments, Curves. And here, if you have it set on RGB, you can lighten up. Do it too much, it's just going to wash it out and it's going to look horrible. So, just a little bit. Like that right there. And there you have it. Hope you learned something, and see you next time.